Hey everyone, it's Ella, and today I'm doing a kind of midsummer haul. It's a really big collective haul of all the things that I've purchased so far this summer, which there are quite a few. Um, before I get started, I want to just say if you aren't subscribed already, hit the subscribe button. And also, I am currently selling a bunch of my clothes on Depop. I'm adding new stuff every single day, kind of just clearing out my closet before I move to New York in a few weeks. So yeah, check that out. It'll be linked down below. It's just Ella Snyder. Alright, so let's just get started with the haul. So I purchased a bunch of things from Zaffle, which has easily become one of my new favorite sites. It's so affordable and the clothing is surprisingly good quality. And this will be a try on haul, so don't worry, you're going to see everything that I bought on my body so you can see like what it looks like. So the first thing that I got from Zaffle, I'm actually so in love with. Um, it's kind of hard to hold up. But it's like this white slash gray it's like an off-white uh glittery wrap top and this is so flattering and so comfortable the material is super soft and stretchy and i love like the subtle glitter in it um and it just looks really good with anything high-waisted i love the next thing i got is this floral set and it comes with a wrap top and shorts in this floral print it's super cute um, my only problem with this was that I ordered it in a size small and it's still a little big on me So if you order the specific set, I would just like to say order down um, Because it does run a little bit large, but super cute all the same. The next thing that I got from Zaffle is this kind of uh, Very business casual kind of top. I don't know how to describe it, but I've seen the exact same thing at Zara So it's definitely yeah it's definitely like a knockoff of some sort, um, but it's just like this one blue and white pinstripe pattern on top and then another blue and white pinstripe pattern on the bottom. It's like a peplum style and then it has black ties on the sides. The next piece that I got is very free people-y. So it's this kind of burgundy dress. Um, it's a little bit short, so just a warning in case you decide you want to go and get this. Um, but it has kind of like a bell sleeve at the end and a button detail in the front. Um, and I thought this would be really good for like a music festival or just days when I'm feeling a little bit more boho uh, kind of vibes. Um, this is super cute and I definitely want to like do like a little photo shoot in this dress because I really like the way that it looks on. The next piece I ordered and I'm not the biggest fan of the way that this looks on my body just because it's not the most flattering dress. Um, but it's a red and white checkered pattern. Um, and it's off the shoulder, which is, I should have just known automatically I don't like off the shoulder things, uh, but I ordered it anyways. And it has these big bows on the shoulders and it ties in the waist and I just really don't like the way that this looks on me. Um, I might sell it on my Depop or just like give it to a friend that it would look more flattering on because I definitely think it would look better on other body types, just not on mine. The next piece that I got is one of my favorites that I purchased from Zaffle. And it is this light blue dress. I wore this for my graduation party because um, I got it earlier in the summer. Um, and it's like little triangles at the top that like cover your nipples. And then uh, it has like little bow ties on the sleeve. So it's adjustable in the straps. And then it just kind of has the peplum detail and then a regular like skirt bottom. And I love this dress. It looks really good on and it makes me look a little bit tanner, which is so nice because I haven't been outside literally all summer. I'm super pale, so I love it. Super good purchase. The next one is something that I always get so many compliments on when I wear it. I put it on my Snapchat and literally so many of you guys responded to my story asking where this dress is from and it's from Zaffle, super cheap. Um, but it's this blue and white pinstripe dress with floral embroidery all over it. It's another piece that I'm pretty sure I've seen from Zara. Um, and of course, Zara was not the first like people to sell a dress like this. Um, but it has like a black and white lace up detail in the front, so super, super cute. And it's just really flattering. It's a very thin dress, so very good for hot days, and it's not see-through, so perfect. The next dress I also got so many compliments on just because it, I think it looks so much more expensive than it actually is. Um, and it's this red and white sheer star dress and I ordered this because there's a specific dress that I wanted from Realization Par that my friend Kat has and it's like $200 and I was like nope I'm not paying $200 for that 
and this dress is literally like 15 or 20 dollars on the zaful website it's just like a wrap dress very simple um but it's so cute i wore it when i was with stefan in virginia um the day that we went to georgetown in dc and it was awesome my only 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 problem with this dress is that i actually ripped it on the shoulder right here i'm not sure what i was doing maybe i just like stretched it too much and tore the seam but yeah i ripped it I still really like it and I'm probably going to order another one to be honest. The last piece that I will be showing from Zaffel is this uh, green uh, velvet square neck tank top with like thin elasticy straps. Um, I ordered this because I thought it would be really fun to either dress up or down and it's actually really funny because when it arrived it had like a fake Brandy Melville tag on it. It said like Brandy Mervalor instead of Brandy Melville and I just thought that was really funny so I guess maybe they sold a piece like this at Brandy like a long time ago but I thought this was really cute and I wear it literally all the time I'm pretty sure I wore it in my last video and I'm obsessed so the next two items that I will be showing you guys are from a store that I recently discovered called Style Nanda and I actually didn't buy these pieces my friend Annabelle bought them for herself and they didn't fit her and she gifted them to me and i'm obsessed with them they're both so cute they're like literally so like my style so the first thing i got from style nanda was a pair of jeans and these just look like regular kind of high-waisted jeans until you see the back of them um each side on the back has like a cut in the calf and it's like a different size and place on each one and when you wear these it looks so cool because it's just like regular jeans in the front and then like cool like distressing on the back so it's like business in the front party in the back you know i'm gonna call these my mullet jeans now <laughs> the second thing i got from style nanda was a maxi dress and i saw these on the website and i've been wanting them for so long and annabelle ordered it and they accidentally sent her two of them and so she gave me one and these look so good styled over a t-shirt i wore it to my friend's birthday party and it looked so cool um, but it's just like this really oversized maxi dress and it's kind of high-low detailing with like, I don't know how to describe this, like I just say like cinching or at the bottom, but it's super cool and oversized like purposefully so that you can wear it over a t-shirt or a turtleneck, um, even over like a tighter jacket. Um, and I'm pretty sure they make these in only one size, which is like why it's oversized because like it's supposed to be worn as like a layering piece and it's super cool. The next thing I got is from Topshop and I actually purchased this while I was in New York and it's just a simple sweater. Um, I actually bought this because I packed for a New York trip thinking that it was going to be super hot and sunny and I got there and it was really cold so I bought this sweater and it's like a baby pink color with a cool like I, I always think of this as like varsity detailing because like every like varsity sweater I've ever seen has like this kind of neckline but it's like a v-neck with a really thick ribbed collar and then the sleeves are just like cuffed like this and it's from Topshop but I got it at Nordstrom Rack on sale it was originally $115 I got it on sale for $16 so not to shoot my own horn but I'm a pretty good deal getter and then last but not least I'm going to be showing things from Brandy Melville because that's literally where I spend all of my Brandy Melville paychecks is at Brandy Melville so yeah I got a lot of clothes from there the first thing that I got is just this hoodie and it's just like a plain navy hoodie. I bought this one day because I was just really cold at work and I didn't own a hoodie this color and you know I just used my employee discount because <laughs> I really wanted a sweater. Um, it's actually really funny because when I was in New York with my friends none of them like have brandy where they live so we had to go to brandy like every single day and my friend actually bought that exact hoodie and I was like I have that man. Then I got this tank top and it's just like a bluish gray color and it has like a tie detailing in the front as you can see it's like a full button up kind of thing and they sell matching pants to go with this but I didn't buy the matching pants. I actually do have the pants just in a different colorway but yeah I love this tank top. It's super summery, very like 1950s in America kind of vibes. Yeah that's how I was feeling about it. Um, and then I got this tank top, which is like a scrunchy black and white 
plaid pattern but it's like scrunchy so you can't even tell that it's plaid and then on the back it has like little bows and it's so cute and summery and I love this with high-waisted jeans high-waisted shorts a skirt anything it looks so good I literally have these two bags full of Brandy Melville stuff so sit back relax and enjoy the rest of the show so these are the pants that kind of go with the shirt but they're literally the opposite colorway I still think they look cute together in my opinion um, but these are just like the Tilden pants in white with the blue striping um, they're so cute and they go with literally everything I also got the tie tank in white with blue stripes like a thin pinstripe pattern um, just because I thought it was so cute and I wanted it in a different color I wore these when I went to the Grand Canyon. I literally own this shirt in like every color we've sold it in and we started selling it in a yellow and white stripe pattern and I had to get it because I love this shade of yellow. It's like the only color of the I love this shade of yellow. I feel like it's the only color yellow that I can pull off. So I had to get this. I'm obsessed. Um, and it's just like the long sleeve t-shirt. I think this one has this one doesn't have a pocket but some of them do. But yeah, I love these shirts. I wear them all the time. I also picked up our new yellow lace bralette. So, so, so cute. Will not be trying this on for the haul, but love it. And I picked up two pairs of socks because I just, like, I'm going to college and I feel like I need to own, like, cool socks. I don't know why. So I got yellow, like, the only color yellow I wear, and black with white stars because these are just so fun and I had to have them. Then I got this other wrap dress this one is navy with white palm trees it's very like hollister abercrombie and fitch kind of vibes and i'm obsessed with it i just think it's like so fun and summery um we sell it in a bunch of different patterns including like yellow with pink flowers white with pink flowers white with blue flowers plain navy navy with white flowers pinstripe plain black we have it in everything guys so just so you know clearly i work at bernie melville then I got this kind of like red crocheted almost tank top. Um, this is so like cropped. It literally could be like a bra top to be honest, but it looks really good on and it like makes my boobs look like I have boobs. So that helps. In fact, I thought that shirt was so flattering that I bought it in yellow too. This is like a mustard yellow. Um, I don't really like the way that this looks on me right now, just like the color. But I'm going to be coloring my hair a little bit darker soon and I think it'll look better then because I don't really like wearing this bright of a yellow with blonde hair. I don't think it like looks really good. Then I got another kind of set. So this is just a square neck loose tank top with tie straps. I also got this in white and I always call this the napkin shirt because the type of cotton that it's made with literally feels like a cloth napkin to me. But I thought this was so cute. I wore it to Six Flags. And I also got the matching Tilden pants to go with it. So they're just like elastic waist and the same plaid pattern. Then I got this Nantucket lacrosse crew neck. And this is like a pale yellow color with red writing on it. And I just got this again because I was cold at work one day. And I thought it was really cute and I would wear it all the time when I'm at college kind of reminds me at home because Nantucket is like a place where everyone from Boston goes during the summer it's like Martha's Vineyard or Cape Cod it's like the same thing so yeah I just wanted to get it it's like a little piece of home when I moved to New York then I got this dress this has been one of our most popular dresses that we've sold this summer and we just got it in this pale yellow color it's like an off-white kind of yellow and I thought this would make me look tan as well and just be really cute on and these dresses are so flattering. I love mine. Um, I have it in the black and white checker print as well. And I got it in another color that you'll see in a few seconds. So the last thing that I got from Brandy is the same dress but in the red and white checkered pattern. Um, when I saw this, I knew I had to get it because Reformation literally makes the same dress. And it was cheaper from Brandy because I didn't want to spend $200 on it. And I just thought it was so cute. I literally wear my black and white one all the time, like I said. And I just knew I would wear this one too. And it would be really cute to, like, layer. So I love this dress and I'm really happy I got it. I almost forgot to mention this piece from Zaffle. But I got this really simple but cute suede skirt. 
and I don't really wear skirts that often but I saw this on the website and I knew I would wear it all the time which I already have so yeah that's everything that I've purchased this summer I'm pretty sure this video makes me look like I have a shopping addiction um, but I promise I don't and if you guys enjoyed watching this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel already, please, please, please do. I would appreciate it so much. We have already hit 40,000, which is so crazy. I can't believe I have gotten this far. I, like, never thought that I would come this far, so that's super cool. And, yeah, all my social media links will be down below. My Instagram is Ella Snyder. Hit me up. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.